Hello everyone and welcome back to another Xano List video. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you the complete process of how you can get an anonymous MasterCard, which can be used in just about anywhere online and in real life. And no, it doesn't require days to get approved. The process is very smooth and fast and you can pretty much set it up within five minutes. So you can go ahead and buy or top up these cards using privacy coins and private stable coins called Xano and Freedom Dollar also known as FUSD. So the first step is you're going to need a Xano wallet address. So you can go ahead and visit xano.org slash downloads, go ahead and download the official desktop wallet app and also the extension here called Xano Companion. It's also available on Brave. So once you've downloaded those and set them up, what you're going to need to do is go to zvec.io. And this is the website here. This is where you can sign up and get the MasterCard. So while you're signing up for ZBEC, it is very important to be using a United States VPN. This is just to ensure that it's a smooth sign up process. So go ahead and scroll down and click on ZBEC Silver. Click Get Card here. It's going to open a new tab, uh, app.card.zbeck.io. And then go ahead and click Create Account here. Now it's going to ask for your email address. Now, if you don't want to use your own email address, you can use Simple Login. Now, basically what Simple Login does is it creates a forwarding address to your email address. I recommend using ProtonMail email address for the core address and then a Simple Login to forward to your Proton email. So I'm going to go ahead and sign up using my Simple Login and an email address will look something like that. Now I'm going to need to enter a name and a phone number. So if you don't want to use the card physically, such as using it with Google Pay or Apple Pay, then you don't need to enter a valid phone number. But if you want to use Google Pay and Apple Pay in stores, you're obviously going to need a phone number to verify the MasterCard within the app, right? So if you don't want to enter your personal phone number, you can use services such as SMS Man, or silent.link and I'll leave these services linked in the description of this video. Okay, so the next step, I'm going to need to enter a US address. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And done. As you can see, my account is now created. So I'm going to go ahead and log in. And now you'll be brought to this screen here. So now I need to connect my Xano companion to Zbeck. And if you don't see the Xano in the drop down here, just scroll down and you'll see Xano there. Then click Connect Wallet. Connect Wallet here. It's going to open up the Xano extension. Accept. And as you can see, it's now connected into this dashboard here. So I can select either Silver, which is a single use, or the Carbon, which is a reloadable card. So I'm going to go ahead and use a Carbon card here. And then I'm going to switch to Freedom Dollar. Then I'm going to select 50 FUSD. And that's going to go ahead and give me a card with this balance here. So I'm going to click Create Carbon Card. I'm going to click Confirm in the Xano Companion app. And there you go. I have now received in my email the card. So now I have gone ahead and clicked the link to get my card, and it has brought me to this screen. So I'm going to go ahead and enter a security question. And there you go. I have now received my virtual reloadable card. Okay, I'm going to click confirm, agree to the terms and conditions here. So now as you can see, it's that simple. I've now received my virtual reloadable card. And if I want to add it into my Android or Apple phone to use in um, Google Pay or Apple Pay, I need to simply enter these card details here and also verify the SMS. Thank you guys for watching this video and I hope you have found this helpful.